Hey guys. Um, got a little bit further in the moving. Or the packing, I mean. Oh, let me set my phone right there. So, uh, let me try to show you guys what I'm doing. Okay, I got some light. Hopefully, it's gonna be enough. Um, it's my wig falling, child. This thing. <laughs> okay, so. Uh, this area over here still pretty much look the same. That's still like the kind of catch-all section over there. Um, added some boxes to the mix. So we got some bigger size boxes. In this one, I've already started putting uh, my vases in there. Right here, this pile is all flower arrangements. So everything that was in the vases is now down there. Here I have laid out all the decor. Everything from every room is now in this in this spot right here. So I should have took a video when I had all the vases out here, girl. <laughs> but anyway, this is what we're looking like as far as um, organizing, which in my opinion will help you, or it's going to help me as far as I can see it in my vision, that if you organize everything in a certain group and then pack it, it kind of makes it a little bit easier. Does it take a... Um, uh, more time yes it does it takes more time but at least everything will be organized so when you get to the new spot all you got to do is just see what it is you're working with you don't have to hunt for things it's gonna help you switch around your ideas and things like that because what I was finding is when I moved I would try and put the things back the same way as the spot I just moved from. No, I don't want to do that here. I want a whole new different vibe. I got some ideas in my head. So I feel like doing it this way, I can see, okay, yes, I want this piece in this room or I want this and put this together with that. You know what I'm saying? So that's how I'm working it right now um this is all seasonal still right there that's still uh, boxes uh, you know empty boxes and things like that I gotta get the shoes down still the garbage area right here all right I'm go up the steps steps and I added this these boxes this one this one is empty that tote is empty this has um, towels and bedding in there oh, no I think just mainly uh, towels that's all that's in there Okay, so in the kitchen, I'm going to stand back here. So in the kitchen, I have my seasonings in there. So I'm not sure if I'm going to put those in the box or if I'm going to leave them. Those cupcakes, those, those cupcakes, those are going to be gone. Um... That's going to stay up the coffee maker. My pots and pans are in here. And I may have to split this up so it's not so heavy. And I, I left these things out um, because I don't want anything in the cabinets. 
That way I can see what I need to pack. Over here is uh, another little catch-all table for upstairs. I got to go through these canned goods and give some food away. Um, this kitchen cabinet, I took everything out of it. It's been packed away. So we're going to use paper plates. Um, those bowls, we'll use that for our cereal and things like that. Cups, that's going to get put away. That's my coffee cup to go. That plate, I'll need that just in case I fry some chicken. Those plates will be put away. And those, that is just uh, plastic silverware. So I'm not sure if I'm going to use it or end up packing it away. Okay. Down here in the under the sink cabinet, I took all of the food like uh, syrup, ketchup, the boys' uh, frozen pops, and some other miscellaneous oil and some other miscellaneous I miscellaneous items. Sugars back there, the grease pots and pans that I want to go ahead and pack those away. I'm probably going to leave this and that in its container it's in already. This side is completely clear. All the way to the back. Just going to go through and wipe that down. That still pretty much looked the same. We went there already. This, these things back here are stains. This is manuals and things that uh, came with the home or ended up coming throughout the years I've been here. This is going to get packed away. I just put the batteries in here so that they're not uh, fluttering everywhere. This is um, pins those push pins so I have that in there that'll eventually go in with the tools this is what the season cabinet looks like now so all that stuff has to come down and come out I don't know if I told y'all um, this side has still got to come out. I got to find some boxes for these plastic containers. Not sure how I'm going to pack that away yet. I have not tackled this side yet. And we will get to that as well. This has been cleaned off. I still got to get that stuff out from up there um, over there is kind of cleared out I put those tall bases there this has been all taken care of I just have to pull those wipes down from there pack that stuff away this I'm going to uh, carry just as it is in those containers because I feel like it's just gonna be easier uh, my room I have not tackled it yet so that's what that looks like okay so I did get some things from over there off and got those packed away so that's just my little update right now guys on how I'm kind of organizing the perfect move if you will or almost perfect because there's nothing perfect on this earth at all not even people sorry
different. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, that's where we are. And I will be back to give you guys another update. Um, yeah, so just staying on my grind, you know what I mean? Just trying to get things together so this can be as smooth a move as possible. Um, yeah, so you guys stay uplifted, stay positive, stay safe, stay at home if you ain't got to go out here because you already know it's still out even though everything is open back up we really have to be careful now even so even more so so um i gotta be out and about um in a couple days so yeah I'm not afraid, it's just the change is, and I'll sit down and talk to you guys about that, how this actually was coming out and um, going back into your work routine and things like that. So I'll do a video for you guys on that, but I want you to stay connected with me because you never know when I might want to cash app you something. And how I'm gonna do the contest or the giveaway. So, mm -hmm. you might wanna stay and watch the whole thing all the way through. I'm just saying. Stay connected to God. Stay focused on God. Stay in His Word. You stay in His Word, you won't be lost. And you won't have. Um, that fear of you know what's gonna happen what's this what's that you'll just go into it knowing I'm good because I got God really oh I need to put that on the shirt <laughs> but y'all stay fancy and I will see you on the next video and know that I stay loving you peace out <laughs>